It's crunch time for the Wollongong Hawks and the Adelaide 36ers. Will the Hawks progress to the grand finals for the first time in franchise history? Well, first, they have to get past the Adelaide 36ers. Phil Smythe's boys are looking to be the first team to make the grand finals from the lowest playoff spot since the Nunawati Specters back in 1981. Well, Steve, I think they have a great advantage in the fact that they're playing here in this building. The atmosphere was great the other day. These fans were standing up a long time. I was wondering how long that Jennifer Lopez song was going to last. They were underway. Room, the layoff is off. Pulls on the offensive rebound, and we have a bucket. Two nothing, the Wollongong Hawks. A lot of their pace right now. Savile with the jump hook over Kevin Brooks is good. Ten on the shot clock. Matt Campbell from long distance knocks down a three. Anyone about a three from the three point line. Melvin Thomas spins on Mark Davis. Top shot. Melvin Thomas with Paul Maley on his back. Melvin to the middle. And that time he's going to be hard to stop. Backs down, Melee spins to the baseline. Good looking shot. He looks tough tonight. He does look tough. And he looks focused. Marr with a pass to Stiff. Block. Hawks with a 10 point lead. 44 34. Kicks it over to Lowry. Matt Campbell has a three. He's wide open. He nails it. Isolated on Rees. Turns to the baseline. Awesome shot. They're going to down low there. To Matt Campbell, he spots up for three. Yes! Into game one of the grand final. Melvin Thomas for a deep three-point bomb. Skips it out to Lowry. Three-point shot from Damon Lowry. Cuts the effort. He gets that one. As Savile goes upstairs with the left hand. 36ers, Dench. Spins to the middle. Good looking shot, and we're all tied up at 82. Lowry, can he get to the rim? Yes. Matt Campbell for three. Oh, big three by Matty Campbell. Melvin, tough jump hook. Oh, my. Great basketball here by both of these clubs. Good. Doesn't score. Well, Dunk has time. Charles oh. Thomas got to give it up. Three. Will he get it up? It's blocked by Darnell. No, he's no. down. He's down to the line for three. Talk about pressure on everybody. It doesn't get any more pressure than this. First one it is short, but it drops in. That's the toughest one. That is the toughest, because that was probably his miss. Adelaide season, they just have to watch Damon Lowry make the He's free teasing throws. Adelaide. He's it up. Oh, my. Two tricklers. This is to get to the grand final. Check the book, but I'm going on the record. What a great win for the Wollongong Hawks for the first time in NBL history. A New South Wales team is going to the grand final. We have not heard the end of this one. This one's going to be talked about for a long, long time. We spoke about the referees and the decisions. It's hard to point the blame at them because it was a line ball. Could have gone either way. What the Phil Smythe was questioning whether the actual shot was actually attempted in the regulation. We couldn't quite tell so far with the, uh, the vision that we had. Dave, 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 get in here. Dave, Dave, Dave. Great Dave job, Larry rattles them all in. A second. He's Derek Rucker on the sideline, or actually on the court, trying to get an interview with Damon Lowry. He's too busy celebrating. With his teammates, Derek, you got to give him a little love for that. He's enjoying the moment. Oh, well, they got to get their hands in. That's fair enough. But we'll get Damon in a second. He said he's happy to talk. And here we go. Damon Lowry. Dave. It's the Dave, shot. Dave, Dave, Dave. Damon wants to have a word. Dave. He's very excited, obviously, Steve. Damon, big shot. Big three shots. I know that's a, this has got to be the highlight of a, of a 
basketball career that's had so many turns. Yeah, D, I can, I can barely hear you, man. Uh, I, I was surprised Kevin fouled me on that three. But um, look, you go to that line, man, that's, I don't know what to say, man. How did you feel when you had those three shots? Were you confident the first? There were three very shaky ones, but they all count. They all count. I was just thinking, uh, get it over the front of the rim. And I'm thinking it might as well be us. It might as well be us, man. It was a very odd game. Where did you find the energy to hang in there and pull that team through? Our team manager find the energy to live another extra six months with terminal cancer. And it's just a basketball game. So we had it in perspective. We like, we ain't quitting for nothing. Damon, great job, and three of the clutchest free throws I've ever seen in my life. Thanks, man. Good luck. Good luck in the grand final. Well, Derek, you aren't lying. Those are the three shakiest free throws I've ever seen. Derek Rucker here is Brendan Joyce on the sideline. Brendan, Brendan Joyce, Brendan, you probably can't hear me. Great victory. You've stuck by Damon for many, many years, and he's delivered you to your first ever grand final. Certainly has. He's won a championship at every level in Australia. Now he's about to play for the biggest one, from the bottom up. And once again, this series took so many, so many turns. With two minutes to go, you guys almost looked out. Did you ever really lose faith in the, in the club and you thought it was over? No, you know, you just keep coaching, trying to, basically I wanted the guys to get the ball inside, but if everything was denied, penetrate. You know, uh, some of the calls didn't go our way, some did. I don't know what to say. I'm just absolutely wrapped, Great job. Congratulations, Brendan. Enjoy the grand final. Glenn Savo, Glenn, big game. Big game, congratulations on getting to the grand final. What do you feel at this moment, man? Oh, man, I don't know what to say. I mean, what a way to end the game. Damon Lowry on the free throw line, the three free throws to win it. I mean, you look at the crowd like this that got us home. It's, I mean, it's an awesome feeling. I mean, I'm, I do find it hard to find it. show a lot of emotion at times like this. And it seems like the strength of your team is your belief in each other. It doesn't matter who gets it done or at what time you get it done. You guys just somehow collectively rise to the occasion. Yeah, I mean, we trailed a lot down the stretch there, and we came up with a lot of big plays. And, I mean, yeah, we all just banded together, and the crowd got us home. Everyone was on their feet for the last few minutes, and what a way to get into the grand final. Okay, Glenn, see you in the grand final. Charles Thomas. I know, it's not, I know it's not a game you're probably proud of. I know who you are. I know how you are. But you hit a big shot, and your team's in the grand final. Well, about that shot, everybody just kept telling me, you know, we got confidence in you, Charles. You've been making that shot all year. So go ahead and keep taking it. I tried to put a dagger in my three-pointer. I missed late in, the, late in the fourth quarter, but my teammates, they, they kept back to me. But that's the character of this team, Derek. We, we never give up. Nobody expected Dave Malarvey to be in this league. And look what he did. Have you, in a row. have you ever seen three bigger free throws made and bounce all over the rim like that? I was going to say, I've seen free throws made at the end, but everyone bounced around in that rim. So it tells me it's our destiny. There's somebody telling us we got to get there, so we got to do it now. Now, which team would you prefer to face in the grand final? Well, I'm going to say that the diplomatic thing is saying it doesn't matter. At first, if we got there, I wanted to play the Titans because they beat us without our full team. We beat them without their full team, but right now they're depleted. Townsville's had our number, so we have to play them. It's going to be a good matchup. So right now, I don't, it doesn't, I, don't, I don't care. OK, Charles, well done. Go shoot. Stop, 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 stop. Well done. I'll see you next week. Melvin Thomas. Excellent game, Melvin. You had a rough series against rough series against Perth. You bounced back strong in this series. And when they needed you, you were the man down the paint. Oh, well, like you said, I, I struggled a little bit in Perth, but uh, you know, this is what it's all about. You know, you gotta step up when the time comes and uh, you know the guys. He was giving me the ball, and I said to myself, I wasn't going to let him down. What about Damon Lauer? He's just fouled time throughout the year. He's probably won three or four games for you just on shots, and now he knocks down three free throws to get you guys at a big dance. Oh, well, um, like you say, you've been doing it for us all year. I don't know, those three, that was probably um, the toughest shot to step up to, the, to that line and hit all three. I, was I told him, I don't have anything else to give him.